Hello everybody, my name is Anthem. What we're going to be doing right now is we're going to be playing The Binding of Isaac. What the game is, it's by the creators of Super Meat Boy. It's like, uh, what do you call them? Rogue Games? What what are they called? I feel like, um, like the rogue, roguelike games. Yeah, that's what they're called. Uh, it's like a roguelike game. You shoot tears and stuff. You collect treasure. And the maps are always randomly generated. I played this game, I think, for about four hours. I'm not good at it at all, and I only have one character unlocked, so I guess we're playing as Isaac. There's not much choice. So you can move with W, A, S, and D, which I find it odd how it's like W, or A, S, C, W on the on the move thing over there. You also got the attack. You can shoot in four directions. Shift and E is using your bomb, and, and you, can see, you can see bombs. I only have one bomb right now. And space using your item, but you don't start off with an item. You got zero, you still have zero keys, zero pennies, but you can find them in the world. And I accidentally used my bomb. Awesome. That could have been much more useful if I didn't. Just kind of shoot all these guys. There we go. Pew, 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 pew. Oh, so, okay, never mind. I got another bomb. So that is good. There's two more of these guys in there. They trapped me in a corner. They, in fact, give me a key. So there's a, there's a, that is the boss room, but I kind of want to find the item room first. So it might be up here. There it is. Oh great, there's flies in here. Too many flies. And flies that shoot blood, I'm, I'm guessing. I don't know what else it could possibly be, I'm so I'm just going with blood. Come on, come on, stop it. Shoot that guy, shoot him, shoot him. There we go, he's dead. So we're going to go to the item room. And the item room does have arrows. Cupid's arrows, piercing shots. Which um, it's, it's an upgrade for our crying tears of cryingness. So I don't know if he do more damage. Does it say here? No. It, no, I don't want you to die. It doesn't actually tell me. I think it just means it goes through them. And we've already found the mini boss on the first floor of the level. Oh, okay. Piercing. Sh okay, I guess that makes sense. Piercing shot goes through enemies. And there we go. He's dead. He drops a little card. He drops card at number zero. The fool. I don't, what's that do? Oh, okay, it spawns us back to the main map. And every map. Uh, every every floor or stage on the Binding Wise deck, each one has a secret room on it, and you can tell where this die already. You can tell where the secret room is because if you can look up on the mini map, it has three rooms adjacent to it. So you see here, this is actually the only option for where it could be because there's two. If it's right there, there's only two, and right there, there's only two. So this is actually the only spot that the secret room could possibly be in. And there it is. So we're gonna go in there. We're gonna see. Oh, he's got six pennies for us. So get those pennies. Hit the mouse off the screen. See, there's a shop up there. You can see on the mini map that's like the very top. But it's not really an option right now since we do not have enough money to really buy anything. Usually you want to go in there when you have about um, 15 cents, which is which will get you like the best thing that you can get. And piercing shots will just. God, I'm so terrible at this. Piercing slash apparently just destroy this boss. So this boss is pretty easy with piercing shots, it seems. Unless he keeps going in weird areas. Get back up here. Get back up here. There we go. Just explode. Come on. Nope. Get get back here. Eh. He doesn't want to stay. Come on. Come on. Come on. There we go. So there goes to this next, the next, what do you call it, room. Get some more health back. Mom's lipstick, which will give us a range increase on our piercing shots. And there's nothing really left up here, so we will go down to the second story of the basement. Basement hot two. And he pulled down his pants. Awesome. Do oh wow, well, this is actually pretty awesome. We spawned right next to the enemy room, which will give us the virus, which is a speed. I just walked into the fire, which is a speed and ranged increase, which is quite nice. There's ha ham, some sort of meat. I don't want to actually know what kind of meat it is. There you go, he's dead. We got more bombs. Go up here, we'll find two more of them, which is good. I walk into fire. The only, there's, there's two... God, I'm so terrible at this. There's two things of me shooting at me, and then I, I end up walking into the fire, which is... Why am I doing so terribly? Ter ter that's not even a word, so, you know, whatever. Come on, come on, come on, come on, go! Maneuvers! There we go, we got maneuvers. There are also rocks, like, let's see all the rocks on the map. There are special rocks which are called, like, tainted rocks, tinted rocks, blue rocks, whatever you want to call them. 
what they do is that pretty much when you break them, they will give you, like, blue hearts, which is pretty much just normal hearts, except um, you cannot refill them. So it's kind of like armor, if you want to think about it like that. Come on. Let's do a fly. There we go, the flight there. Oh, and you got a penny. Do 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 do. No, we don't really want to use that. What that is, this machine, which is right in the middle of the room, it pretty much trades your hearts in for money. So, and it, but if you blow it up, normally, oh sweet, it gave us two of these armor hearts. But no, sometimes it'll either drop, you know, armor hearts. It'll give you sometimes money, and it might also give you like normal, you know, red hearts, so you can heal up again. And then with our piercing hearts, we will. We were supposed to be able to easily destroy these guys, but they don't really want to be easily destroyed. Come on! Kyan will kill all the flies that you spawn. Your, your spawning flies will be dead. There we go. And come on, come on, die. die. I hope to find um, one of those blue rocks, because then I can show you what it looks like. Oh, we got another penny. We, can't, we need like four more pennies, and great, we got these guys. These are like the worst guys in the game. Okay, and whoops. You kind of just gotta. Ah, you kind of walked into them. That was stupid. Walked into them again. I'm so bad at this. Come on, stop it. Dude, 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 dude. One's dead. Kill the next one. Kill the next one. Come on, he's right there. Just, just kill him. There we go. Finally. Oh, sweet, got another armored heart. There we go. We can go in there, but that is kind of a bad idea, since we do not have much health. It's just one of those battle rooms. So there's two areas in which the secret room can be. We only have one bomb, so let's just try here. And it was not there, so we kind of just wasted our bomb. It's actually right there. That's good. We kind of just wasted that. We could have went to the the store if we found money in there, but we didn't. And we did, we actually we didn't find it at all. So our next boss is going to be Gemini. -ny. And what he does, he's pretty much just this guy, and he kind of walks around. They got a little baby thing that spits blood at you. This guy, it's okay because he gets tired all the time. So he's not—he's. I think he, he might be one of the easiest bosses in like the basement areas. Was just what? The, but the, God, my bullet, my my, my damage is like nothing to him. Stop shooting blood at me, little baby thingy. What? Come on, come on, kill him. There we go. And then the little baby after that pretty much just follows you around, doesn't even. It's actually not really even that much of a threat, because you can just kind of easily outrun. Unless you stop, and then you let it just walk, run into you. That's that's something you can possibly do as well. Pew, 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 pew. Pew, 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 pew. Pew, 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 pew. Come on, just die already. You're almost... There we go. Oh, look. It's breakfast. And what breakfast does, it will give me an extra heart. Was there any rooms, actually, that did give me the tinted rocks? Hmm, let's we kind of just look around here. No, so I kind of want to get some extra... Destroy fire can also give you items. Look, there's actually a penny right there. If we can actually find pennies in here, or bombs, which... I just realized I don't even have any bombs, so looking for tinted rocks is kind of actually pointless. So let's just go now to the next level. Do do bam 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 Okay, let's go. Doop! Now we're going down to the caves level one. <laughs> and he's he's crying because he's got the he's got the bad dreams. So let us go up here. Oh, these are bomb flies. And if you couldn't guess what they do by their name, they are bombs and they fly. I don't think the red one's a bomb fly. I think the red one is like I just kind of want to destroy the bomb fly when you're not near it because. See, there we go. Yeah, that one just kind of shoots in six directions. There we go. And we got a bomb. And we got a key to go in this room. And we found some mom's underwear, which will give us another ranged increase. So that is indeed good. Probably could have found a better item. We don't even have any actual, like, space bar items. And you can see this once. This The one guy is kind of spitting blood at us. You can see that he's kind of discolored. And that his things that he is firing out of us, at us. You can see that they are... Um, they're bigger than what the other guy had, which means that they, they actually do one hit point of damage. Which is like the entire heart. This guy doesn't want to seem to die though. Come on. There we go. It seemed like he wasn't going to die anyway. 
Is there any tinted bombs and rocks in here? No? Come on. And... Oh, come on, there's a troll bomb in there. Give me, give me a null bomb. There's a boss room. Don't want to go in there. Probably find two more pennies in order to go to the store. Which will be good. And then there is the little kid. We can give him money in order to... What do you call it? He might... He, he, he randomly might give you an item. Before I redo that, I kind of want to see if we can go find a room, or not a room, go find some two more pennies and see if we can go to the store. If there's nothing good at the store, then we can just go to to the little kid. Destroy the poop, because the poop can give you items, which it's not going to right now. We can go down right here. There's a bunch of little faceless worms. They don't really do anything. Unless you walk into them, then they do damage to you. Why am I so terrible at this? Okay, just kind of shoot more little worm thing creatures. Come on, come on, shoot them, shoot them, there we go. And then your dad gives another bomb. Great, not these faces. These faces suck. I, I don't like these guys. And, they, and they're moving, and there's no cover. You get... Stop shooting at me. God, I can't... Am I hitting them? They keep turning red, but I can't tell if that's because they're firing or because I'm hitting them. There we go. So it looks like there's actually... Th From what I can tell, it looks like there's actually three rooms in which the uh, the bonus secret room can be. So, But we do have three bombs, so we can check... Now we have four bombs, so we can check all of those locations. And we found Gluttony, who will shoot giant red laser beams out of his stomach and shoot bomb, shoot little red circly things in every direction. Come on, come on. It's gonna fire at us, do a little bit of damage. Avoid that shot. I really don't want to die in the case for one, because that is actually pretty pathetic if you die in there. Die, die, you're almost dead, you're almost dead, there we go. And he gave us some health. How wonderful of him, there we go. So we will check all of the bonus rooms. See if they give us anything useful. And there we go, found it, first time. And we got a one up. One up is really, really helpful, because what that means is that if we die, we can respawn. Normally in this game when you die, you actually do not get to come back to life, and you kind of just stay dead. So because we couldn't find the couple of cents, we will, I'm just going to try this guy. Maybe give him three pennies, so just get us on an even ten. And there we go, he gave us a bomb. Come on, come on, I can't really get the bomb. I gotta, I gotta kind of avoid the kid, so he just... There we go, got a bomb. And now let's go and try to fight the boss for the first area. Yeah, this is quite good. Oh, wait, look at that, you see on the mini-map, you see those little hearts? Let me just kind of gather every one of those before we leave and fight the boss. It's a good thing I remember that, because if I didn't, then we could have probably died here much easier. There we go. Almost at full health. There's missing half a heart, which isn't too bad. I don't know if you die with the 1-up, though, if it will give you all your items back, or if you start off by, like, basic Isaac. Can't. Don't really know. We're fighting Chubb. He's just a big worm. He's a big worm that shoots other little littler. Great, thanks for that. I know you can get him to eat bombs. See, like that. There we go. Eat the bomb, Chub. Chub, Chub. Was that his name? Yeah. I already kind of forgot. It's kind of sad. Oh, I killed one of his little worms with that. And he just ate his little worm friends. Which, which is kind of upsetting, Chub. Don't, don't kill your little worm friends. Oh, he's almost dead, he's almost dead, he's almost dead, there we go, start crying, start crying your blood, bloody tears. And then you gotta kinda kill all the little enemies in the room as well. Great, how, how pathetic of me. Why do I, my tears do like no damage, it's kinda sad. And another health upgrade, rotten meat. How delicious. So let's go down to the caves, part two. Two. There we go. Okay, and a little thing, and then you fall, and you break your legs. Beautiful. Wait, that, that, wait, that's. Never mind. There's so many little worms in here. Let's put a bomb in the middle. Oh, see, we got two of them. Whoop, whoop. Stop charging at me, worms. 
You're not chargers. Ow, I walked into him. Maybe I should learn how to avoid stuff instead of walking into it. There we go. And we got a key so we can go to the item room on this floor. Oh god, we found the most annoying thing in the game, which is right there, as you can see. And there's also spikes in this room. Beautiful. How many times am I going to walk into the spikes? Who knows? Probably too many. Come on. Kill the fly. Come on. Pop out of your little hole thing. Come on. Come on. Yeah, there you go. There you go. Die. I almost walked into the fly, which is pretty sad. There we go. And he dropped the key right there. We can't get the key if we blow up this rock. But I don't... I'll, I'll see if it's worth it in the future. At all. Okay. Oh, this is actually a pretty good shot with our piercing um, arrows. Thanks. Whoop, whoop. Whoop, 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 whoop. What, got, there's one more. Oh, hey, guy. There we go. And he drops a tarot card, which might be good. Does he enter? What's this? What is this? X-ray vision. I've seen everything. I don't actually know what the X-ray vision goggles does. Oh, I think I know what it does. Actually, never mind. What I think what it does is it will show you the secret room or when you are next to it. I kind of want to get that tarot card. Because we don't really need the bomb anymore for the secret room. If that is... Wait, no, never mind, we do still need this. What's the tower do? I don't want to use it right now until before we get to the boss. We got 10, so we got, still got 10 cents. We're almost dead, which isn't very good. Ah, there's a secret room. Avoid, go into the secret room where there is a ton of money. A ton of money, there we go. We, and now we can go to the store, which is very helpful. There we go, No, nothing in there though. I kind of want to not go talk to those enemies right now. So if we can find a bomb and or a key, that would be good with, for us. But until then, we're kind of just going to shoot these flies. Come on. Come on. Come on. Why, are they, why do they have flies inside of them anyway? It doesn't really make much sense. You're dead. You're dead. Bomb. Key. There we go. We're going to the store. Come on. Give me that. Going to the store to buy some atoms. There's another key there. But we're going to the store. Let's go to the store. Oh, and it was greed. Awesome. Mini boss inside of the store instead of an actual store. Ow. That was kind of sad. Oh, we dropped money. Oh, we dropped more money. Oh, I get, oh, I get money every time I get hurt. What's this card do? Oh, it drops bombs everywhere. Not a single one useful. Oh, God. I'm about to die. I'm about to die. I'm about to die. I died. Oh god, how did I manage to even die there? That's kind of sad, but I'm not going to the store anymore. And we lost our one-up mushroom. But we're not dead, and now I know that's a trap, so screw it. We're, we're going over here. Or did I lose money every time I got shot? I mean, that might have been what was happening, actually. Let's kind of... Kill that guy. Boop. Come on, come on, come on, nope. We'll kind of avoid them. Ooh. Come on, go there, and then kill this guy. And we got a key, which is good. If we find maybe a treasure chest, we could use that. Oh, wait, there's a room up here. I didn't even notice that. Why does... Oh, I don't know. For some reason on my screen, it looked like I never didn't go there, even though I did. Oh, TNT! TNT! Bump! Bump! Oh, God. Wow, that really lagged my computer. Oh, my God. Come on, kill him, kill him. Whoop. And kill him, kill him. Kill him, kill him. There we go. And we got a key for that. Oh, we didn't get the, the bonus hearts from the thing. Well, that's kind of upsetting. But where is the boss? He's not here. Oh, yeah, no, no, never mind. He is. Of course. Thank, thanks for doing this. Yeah. Let's go to the arcade. We can't go to the arcade. Trying to avoid their shots. One's dead. Oh, got hit. Good work, Will. Good work. You're you're terrible at this. What? Done. And go around. Oh, flanking. Strategy. 
Ow, good work. Let's go to the arcade. Do 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 do. Let's let's just play the slots machine because it does give us the potential of getting hearts or more money. It also has the potential to giving you like a dollar, which is about 99 coins. So then we can spend the entire episode playing this machine all day. If I don't keep failing at this game. Yay, a nickel! Let's play some more. We, we will we will have a gambling addiction in the mining wise. Like that sounds like a good idea. Whew. Another penny. So that that pretty much means that the play was pointless. Boop. Bam, bam, bam. Give me that. Come on, come on. We'll just win the game once. Oh, look at a penny. I want something that isn't just more money. I want something useful. Two pennies. Oh, that's much more useful. Much more useful. Not really. A nickel. We can pretty much play this all day game. There we go. Give me a heart. Thank you. Great. Thanks for spawning an enemy game. Awesome. Just give me, like, more hearts. Awesome. Fine. Did I play the game too much? Fine. I'll just play with this kid. A oh, heart. Heart is good. That was not the right one. <coughs> a bomb. Let's just go with the middle one. Another fly, give him more money, penny, in the middle, a penny, or oh, two pennies, thank you little kid, a bomb, let's just go with the middle one again, two bombs, awesome, and this, let's blow that, that blood bang thingy, give us a heart and a half, nice, play with the kid some more, a key, Thanks for the fly. Thanks for the fly. Another bomb. Two bombs. Nice. We're doing well on this little kid. This kid is much more helpful than the slot machine. The slot machine just sucks. What if I can blow up the kid with the bomb? That might be interesting. Come on, you have one more penny. Something good, something good, something good. Sweet, two bombs. Let's try to blow up the kid. Oh god, <laughs> you can blow up the kid! Oh, it gave me a spirit heart. Thank you, little kid. Now we can go fight the boss. Peep! What are you doing? It's peep. It's P-E. That's... I wasn't expect I was expecting him to jump kind of where I was. I keep thinking it's not it's not the monstro. He doesn't jump where I am. I keep forgetting that part. And he's in like the most he's in the worst position possible for me. Come on. Come on, just cry on him. Cry him to death. Isaac. I um, mean one of his eyes fell out. Beautiful. Once is I think I think it's I either I will fall. Ow! Of course he avoids my bomb. Good work. If I can avoid his projectiles, everything would be going better right now. Like everything, quite literally, everything would be going better right now. Now both of his eyes are out. I hit him with my projectile! I hit him with my bomb! I hit him with my bomb! I hit it! I hit him! I hit him! Come on! I don't have more health! I don't have extra HP! I don't have extra lives! But I should- Isaac! Oh, Isaac! You got this, Isaac! No! 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 I'm not dying to this boss! I... Am not dying to this boss! I thought, oh god, they died as I. Oh god, thanks everybody for watching. 
This has been the binding of Isaac. God, I let him kill me, kill me by his eye. Remember, you can watch The Binding of Isaac before it goes up on YouTube at www.twitch.tv slash bomberoverlords and you can find out when I will be live streaming on Twitter www.twitter.com slash bomberoverlords which is like SP4WN and you go on Steam Group which you, I don't even know what the Steam Group actually is it's, it's called Slayer and Squid, just look it up on the Steam Group community area on Steam so then you can kind of look up on all those places to see when I'll be live streaming The Binding of Isaac. I'll also be making posts on YouTube too. Uh, that, as well as when I record some more Happy Wheels. So I was going to record some more today, but it turned out the website was being weird and I couldn't actually play any of the maps. But anyway, thanks for watching. This has been a this has been Anthem, also known as Spellmore Overlords. Remember to subscribe and leave a thumbs up. Okay? Goodbye.